Good morning students. Hope you are doing well at home. Today we are going to learn about how to calculate the volume. So let's get started. All 3D objects around you have a volume. The sofa you're sitting on, the phone you're holding, and even the hot dog on the plate next to you. But why is this important to you? Well, knowing this for example, you can figure out how much water you need to fill in your pool, or whether or not the gift you bought for your friend can fit in the box you're wrapping. So what is volume? It's the measure of the amount of space inside an object. These could be a cube, cylinder, cone, pyramid, or even a sphere. The volume of anything with straight sides is the area of the base times height. That's why the formula for a cube is length times width times height, or edge times edge times edge, which is edge cubed. Notice the little 3 at the top. That shows that the shape is three-dimensional. So it's simple. To find the volume of any cuboid, you multiply the given three dimensions and you have your volume. In case you are not provided with the dimensions, you can always find the volume by counting the cubes. For example, in the shown cuboid, you can see the number of rows are 4, number of 1 cm cubes in each row are 5 and number of layers are 3. I hope now you understand how to find the volume. Practice the questions given on textbook page number 50 and 51 and submit your work in Google Classroom for teacher's feedback. Thank you.